Hi, my name is Sonia Farid, and today I'm going to solve this problem. It says, given the matrix A, find elementary matrices E1, E2 to EK, so that EK times uh, E2, E1A equals U. And what's that? What that's saying is it wants it to you want it wants you to find an upper triangular matrix. And in a sense, what that means is these three numbers should go to zero. So it kind of makes like a an upper triangle upper triangle of numbers. And so your first step, you want to write out the identity matrix, which is I equals 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. And what you want to do is you want to get you want to get this 3 to be a 0. So the first step would be to say R2 equals R2 plus 3R1. And so when you do this operation, to the identity matrix, you get the value 1, 0, 0, 3, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. And now you're going to multiply, this, is, this would be your first elementary matrix, E1. And you're going to multiply it times the original matrix, and that will give you the matrix negative 1, negative 3, negative 4, 0, 1, negative 22, negative 2, negative 4, 11. And what this is, this is E1A. Okay, so now you want to get rid of, you want to make the negative 2 a 0. So what you're going to do is you'll say R3 equals R3 minus 2 R1. And so you perform this operation on the identity matrix, and so that gives you the identity matrix 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, negative 2, 0, 1. And this is E2. And so now you want to perform that, you're going to multiply E1A times E2 to get your next set of matrices, or your next, your next matrix, and that'll be negative 1, negative 3, negative 4, 0, 1, negative 22, and 0, 2, 19. And what this is, this is E1, E2, E1A. Now your last step, you want to get rid of this 2. So what you're going to do is you'll say, I'm going to write it over here, you'll say R3 minus R2, minus 2R2, you'd say R3 equals R3 minus 2 R2. And that's going to, when you perform that on your identity matrix, you get the new matrix 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, negative 2, 1. So this would be E3. And then now you're going to multiply this times this to get your new matrix. And you get the matrix negative 1, negative 3, negative 4, 0, 1, negative 22, 0, 0, 63. And what this matrix right here represents is E3, E2, E1 times A, which is also U, which is your upper triangular matrix.